Today I'm going to show you how to use Jive to send out EDMs to your friends and family. Now that the Mid-Autumn Festival is around the corner, I'll use that as a demo. So now I'm here at the Jive dashboard where I can do most of my work. And I just need to get started by clicking on campaigns. Then I click on a new campaign. This is an email campaign, alright? And let's call the subject Happy Mid-Autumn Festival. And click on Create and your campaign will be created very quickly so next I just need to click on this one and um, that's where I create my email alright so let's choose the mid-autumn festival theme which I uploaded earlier and see it's very pretty uh, of course I need to change the content in the center here and I just need to click on edit content and just change it so let's see let's say dear you can insert a custom tag, you know, the, the names of your friends and family and Jive automatically inserts the names individually so dear first name, John, whoever it is here's wishing you a happy mid-autumn festival there you can sign off, warmest regards Sean Lim if you want, you can also add in, you know, your company website or company address so they remember where you're from. And let's just bolt this and itemize this. Let's do that for my name as well. Scroll down, click on save, then click on close. And the system automatically updates. So you can see here, dear first name, here's wishing you a happy mid-autumn festival. Warmest regards, Sean Lim. Very beautiful. And this is what your friends and family will see when you send it out. The next step will be to add an address book. That means the list of people you're going to send to. So for me, I named my address book Sean under my own name. And uh, in this sample, there are six contacts. So I'll just add them first. Check this. Add and close. And you can see Sean's friends all here. All right. And let's, of course, you'll need to set the start date uh, and time. Let's send it almost immediately, about five minutes from now. If everything looks okay, you of course of course you can click the test button first to make uh, send a test email to yourself to make sure everything looks okay. After you've done that, click save, and if you're good to go, click activate, and you're done. 